Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play uh, Immortals Phoenix Rising. So, off screen I was able to clear out the uh, Forge Lands of all the things I need to get. Um, there are still a few chests I haven't gotten, mostly because those are um, uh, involved in a quest or are just like, hey, something here you may want to get. Sorry, hold on a second. Just had some breakfast. Okay. Uh, basically all I did was just run around and collect everything, so we are pretty set to go on everything. So, let's just get to it. Um, we're gonna start over here. Today's set is gonna be dedicated to hunting down the legendary and mythical creatures. Well, not mythical, but legendaries. And lieutenants, I guess. Um, can't really think of anything else to talk about with what I got. Oh well. Jeez. A lot farther away than I anticipated. Next time we'll do the uh, Vault of Tartarus if we have time. There is. What I'm looking for. I think he's right there. Yep, there he is. Unlock on that. And that's set to go. Jeez, you a big boy. Slash! Let's go! Hi! All that stamina damage, I love it. Also, uh, most of my abilities are learned now, which is great. I might be able to take on uh, that Harvey for Athena. Nope! <laughs> I have a good combo going too. Bam! Fuck you! What I get for that, it sh this is legendary, it should be a phosphor skin, right? Yep. Phosphor of Heat's Core. Hmm, I like it. Alright. Uh, yellow was the one we just did. So I'll go ahead and unmark that. Let's see what uh, Heat's Core does. Boop. Grab it. Uh, oh, cool! So it's a bigger explosion whenever he uses attack. Awesome. Um, I decided to switch over to the Blood of Typhon armor set as well because it's a pretty good armor set. Plus an extra 28 defense. Nice. Mostly for the helmet. The 18% chance uh, triple damage on hit. So, yeah, pretty good. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. Next is... You. Some of these uh, things we're doing is also part of the story, so we, get, we can get prepped for it. There was one uh, puzzle that I did solve that I wish I didn't. It was one of those things like I finished it and I was just sitting there going, I kind of wish I would have kept that. Uh, there is a forge we can light uh, over there somewhere that is based off of Prometheus's fire, and it's a really cool puzzle. I like it, but uh, I kind of forgot. Lieutenant Brontus, this, if memory serves, is one of the giants that helps affect this as forge. <laughs> Yeah. I love the eye frames. Come on. Fuck you. Pretty much at this 
point, once I have uh, the potions active, I can just cut through enemies. Or just destroy enemies' uh, defense. Sorry, Brontus. Cyclops, there must be a snarky one eyed joke. Or you could, you know, applaud the warrior on her achievement. Shield bearer. Still stuck on that, huh? Dick. Alright, uh, let's see here. We'll head up there last, I think. This... No, no, no. We want to do this one first. Uh, where's a quick way of getting there? Oops. Let's also get rid of that. I do want to tag this as well because this is important for later. Damn, not really much over there. I can fast shovel too. Alright, let's fast shovel up here then. I'm glad I'm glad we're about halfway done. Well, we're not really about halfway done. Uh well we're actually a little under halfway, I guess. By the way, I I got a um uh unknown warrior armor piece set. Or not set, uh, armor. I'm, I'm at weapon. It's the axe on my back, as well as a bow, which is great. I love mixing and matching. I love matching. Which way am I going? I'm going towards red and yellow. All right. So this way. I'll get out of their range soon enough. Load. Ah, right, because I'm still technically in battle with them. So we want to get up there. I'm probably also going to do the uh, quest that's there too. Because doing the fights is kind of quick. There it goes. This place has a lot of, uh, uh, nectar. Ironically enough. Which is useful. I, I was able to finally upgrade, um, the nectar's, uh, defense to max, so I have double the defense whenever I have, whenever I have it active. So, really useful. Sorry, I had to sneeze. Still have to, but uh. there is the thing. There he is. Ah, oh, fuck! It's a flyer, so I can't do a stealth attack. That's fine. Let's do this. Come here, buddy. Go nowhere, bitch. Come here. Ah, fuck. I'm leaving the area. I dodge that bullshit. Alright, come back it up. Barry, but I'm happy about it. What'd I get? Ooh, carnivorous phosphor. Awesome. Alright. Uh believe this mission's pretty easy too, so let's go ahead and just do this quick. All these ones are really quick. Oh, it's a portal! That's easier. That means it's like a dungeon. Easy to solve. Them. What? Land. Okay, let's do it. Let's 
So what's the, uh, dealio? Environmental hazards has been added. Okay. Ah, uh, I see, I see. Find a fire source. Oh, wait. I uh, apparently ran off the edge and did a double jump without even meaning to. Alright, so I have to book it. There we go, warm up. Okay, so don't sprint jump, because apparently I can't do that very well. I'm also not out of potions. Still doable, but annoying as fuck. Definitely lost God stuff. Oh, made it. Ow. Is there a chest here? Ah, fuck. Don't care about your shield. Fuck you, dick. Is there a chest? Suck. Hey, this thing stay warm. I should time that kind of nicely. times on this thing. My abilities. I'm 
assuming it's an armor bonus, based on what I've equipped. I have no clue what it is, though. I don't remember this armor. Right. I know I have to do something with that. Can I just go up there? I feel like I'm missing something important. Huh. Well, I guess we're taking this with us. Up we go. I can't jump. I can't uh, jump with that thing. That was uh, stupid on my part. Man. At least I don't have to fight it again. I feel like I'm missing something. This obviously is important because it has a uh, writing on it. Yeah. Um. That's the exit, all right. I don't want to complete it because it feels like I'm missing something important. Okay, sure. I'm gonna look up and see what that's about. Cause I feel like I missed something. Yes. I may reload just to see what, what that's about. Is that, uh. I feel like I missed something. Did I get the thing? I got the fig. Yeah, I definitely feel like I missed something with that. That's weird. Right, what's the fig do? Oh, cool! Give me a 20% uh, uh, HP back uh, when I kill someone. Nice. That worries me. Well, I guess we'll find out uh, later. Like I said, I'll look it up uh, when I have the time. All that. Uh, we want to go to yellow next. Was it green? Yeah, yellow. <laughs> Something down there we want to grab. Technically, I could get it later, but this will just save me a bit of uh, time when we get to that point in the, uh, the game. So there's a puzzle here that I kept un, uh, unsolved. Because we kind of need it. Oh, horses. Worry about that later. puzzle this, it's just I decided to keep it. Just to show how to get inside this place. There we go. Check. 
shade. Got it. That easy. And the reason we're here is for that, the Olympian key. That will be used uh, later on. Okay, so that's solved. Or that's done. Got rid of that. Next, we're heading down over here. I'll probably do this as well. But I'll work my way up to it. Because there's a fast travel spot right next to it. Um, if there's time, we may do the, uh, the Fire and Ice quest as well, or Fire and Thunder, whatever it's called. It's another DLC item, or quest I mentioned earlier. Sorry, just trying to crack my thumb. Hold on a second. There we go. I've always had stiff joints, especially my fingers, so every so often I have to do that. Oop, didn't mean to do that. And I know, I know what a lot of people say, it's going to give you arthritis. It actually helps prevent arthritis. So, yeah, lovely. Alright, now if memory serves, I actually wanted to hunt this guy since we started, because he has something cool. I don't remember what it was, though. Like, I remember looking up videos when I first started playing this game. For all the wings, phosphor skins, armor, stuff like that. Like, what is a good design to have your Phoenix play? And I remember hunting him down. Ah, uh, Talos the Rebuilt. Talos actually is a, um, anachronistic character, kind of, in the uh, Odyssey. He's basically this, a robot. He even bleeds black blood. Oops. Sorry, Talos. I believe his flaw was that he had uh, one thing. That was protected by a nail, and if you remove it, he died. There we go. While we're sitting here, let me actually look up Talos. Hopefully, it doesn't give me, you know, Skyrim stuff. Ah, burnished phosphor. That's right. Talos Greek. Alright. Uh, the myth describes Talos as a giant bronze man built by, Herfe by Hephaestus, the Greek god of invention and blacksmithing. Talos was commissioned by Zeus, the king, of the, uh, the king of the Greek gods, to protect the island of Crete from invaders. He marched around the island three times every day and hurled boulders at approaching enemy ships. Talos was... Uh, the Argonauts were, uh, were desperate for food and water, and Medea decided to use her magic to kill Talos. She sent forth baneful phantoms, and as Talos was trying to stop them from reaching uh, Tikiti, whatever, uh, Europa's hideout, he accidentally grazed his ankle on a pointed crag, releasing the ichor from his single vein. So yeah, that is the story of Talos. Uh, and as I said, he's a bit ac uh, anachronistic because of the fact that he is, well, a robot. That's essentially what he is. Right. And that was my marker for funny colors. I should take a look at that uh, phosphor we got. Ooh, nice. Triple damage on hit with phosphor's attack. During a Typhon's Rage. So that's useful when uh, Typhon's pissed at us. Fossil clones explode. We don't need to worry about that. 
Alright. Let's get this chest. And be on our way. There is another location we're going to stop by. Because I kind of... I found it by accident. Thankfully I remembered it and saved before doing it. There's another uh, magic stone we can grab. Which is a part of another side quest that is a DLC. There we go. I think it's DLC. Should be. Here. There's another Nike fragment here as well, which I'm going to have to record uh, later. Stirpus. This is the other uh, uh, person who works for Hephaestus. Hephaestus. Hephaestus? The blacksmith god. And slash. Nope. Get some good damage up on him. Damn, look at that combo. Bam. Maybe I should have killed him with a uh, fight to the Sporge. Or a hammer. Sorry, See Stepos. you in Hades, Steropis. I never liked that guy. Of course you didn't. He only made your lightning. It was shoddy work. You know I didn't tip him. Oh, that's just rude. <laughs> so the Nike fragment is up there. You guys should kind of see the thing. Alright, yes. so this... Right, 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 okay. Alright. I remember this puzzle. Kind of. All under. Pick that up. Drop. Where is the other rock? Or the other, um, cube. I don't see the cube anywhere. A lot of fucking rocks, though, that's for sure. What if I can... Thread the needle. Nope! Maybe it's in here. No. Okay, how do I want to do this? I might... Yep. Do the system. The loop. What we got? Ooh, nice. Armor based off of uh, the lion stuff. Nice. Ooh. All right, that was easy. All right, so that is done. Back here for Nike later. Mark that. Head to the aqueducts. Hmm. All right, and up there. Actually, pretty good spot. Got yeah. surprised. This is a part of the quest Phosphor gave us, if memory serves. Bear. All right. Go around. Wait for them. Ha. 
Half an hour. Damn, I went through this quickly. This. Alright. So the enemy we're going to be fighting is here, but he hasn't spawned yet because we need to do that quest. Alright, that's what I thought. It's off. I'm so glad I finally got all my abilities back. All my god abilities. It's so good being able to zip around like that. So much fun. Alright, let's do this. I see something. That must be the clue. Where are you, enemies? Show yourself! Or are you having this one fight your battles for you now? Well, so be it. Bring it, bird face. Yeah, cute. Yeah, he's not that strong. Get back to stamina. Now nah, you fall down, buddy. the ultimate warrior sanctuary there's a decision to be made don't be a bust treasure is best left to its own devices and a key phosphor thank goodness you're safe he says that you let the griffin get away which in my honest opinion is a good thing you would think being carried across the sky by a griffin would be full of wonder, but let me tell you, it was not. Plus, I'm allergic to cats. Well, there's always a next time. You live, you learn. Oh, nice one. He says you're a sorry excuse for a warrior. How's this bird doing for you so far? It's a work in progress. Rome wasn't built in a day. Rom? Yeah, it was our neighbor's house. He kept on having sons, so he kept on adding rooms. But then they all died from a plague, so now it's an inn named Rom, after the eldest son. May you deliver him to Keron safely. Oh, that ship has sailed. He didn't have the coins, so Cerberus ate him. Rom, 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 Rom. <laughs> Too soon. That's a funny joke, considering Rome wouldn't have been around during, uh, Phoenix's time. So, since they mentioned, um, uh, her family fighting in the Trojan War, yeah. Alright, so... There are a few other things we want to grab. One is right here. I don't remember where the other one is exactly. But I don't think it's too far from this location. Run, 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 run. Come on. Damn, that went back quick. Like, I'm, I'm surprised how quick that went. I was expecting to be uh, doing the fights a little bit longer, at least from getting A to B. Charge. So we want to get up there. There we go. Then it was down here. I'm about to 
fight some harpy, aren't I? Great. Hi. Come here, you. Falling to that laser beam. Jump! There we go. Ah, fuck it. Alright. So, down here, we want to grab this. Left automaton hand. Now we need the right one. I believe. If I remember correctly, is down there. Um, let me double check that to be certain. So we want the right one. <laughs> Come on. Images, let's see here. Ah, now that helps. Alright, fuck it. Like I said, I think it's down here. Thankfully, they sparkle so they're this easy to place see. Looks like a battlefield. Or a graveyard. Yep, there it is, I see it. Hi. Ah, uh, two for one still. Love it. Yeah, this is gonna save me some hassle in the future. Where is it? There it is. Hi! Come here, you. Hi! Piss off! That will save us so much grief in the future. Alright, next location we're going to is this. Kinda wish there was a fast travel spot I could get to there. There was if I would have done this already. Uh, don't see anything over there. Damn it. Alright, let's go. Glad I remembered the, the location of that other hand. Or else that would have caused me a bunch of issues later on. Huh. It's not that it's difficult to find it, it's just annoying. Because you don't have a quest marker. If you do it this early, that is. I do believe if you do it when you're supposed to, you'll have a marker. Let's fly up. There we go. Hey, yeah. Alright, uh, this way. Uh, next set, if I decide to do the horse uh, gathering off screen, which I will, of course, but, uh, what's that? I don't remember doing that. I legit don't remember this. Did I miss this? Or did just say thing? Um, one of my favorite horses can be gained in this area, so... In the Forge Lands. So I'm looking forward to getting it again. Fuck you, Chimera. Fuck off! There we go. Oh, beautiful!
Only would be better if I got enough stamina back to zip myself to him. Huh. Weird. Oh well. I wonder if that was a uh, planned event. But they never got around to it. Type of a thing. Like that, they had a plan for another DLC and they decided, eh, fuck it, no, no, no one likes this game. Or something, I don't know. Which again, this game does not get enough love. I love this game. Now we're heading down there. I believe, yep, that's the, uh, the forge I mentioned earlier that had, uh, Prometheus' flame. Zeus threatened to, uh, peck out, or set an eagle to peck out, uh, Phoenix's liver for reigniting it. It was great. It was after I finished it, and was off doing something else that I had already saved, that I was like, man, I really wish I would have saved that. It's a simple little puzzle, too. Let's go. Let's see here. In Helios's temple. Kind of where that Helios's temple is, right here. In the middle of the ocean. Because Helios is the son of the the, uh, the god uh, no, the god of the sun. I guess it kind of makes sense. It's on the horizon. That's where the sun sets. There's also a chest inside of this temple. Phoenix was amazed by the majesty of the island. But she knew that something special lay within the temple of Helios. Alright, so how do I solve this again? Oh, right, fuck. I'm gonna need to solve the puzzle first, which is bring all these silver horses here. Maybe I can, uh, herd them in there. Nah. Alright, we'll, uh, worry about this next time, then. Because, uh, I wa I'm trying to record all of the... Attack that. All of the, um... Mounts, so I can't really do that if I have one already. Although, what I can do is this and reload it later to uh, record the video for it. That's what I'll do. Oh, it's a level two horse too. Nice. Can I get that horse. See, so yeah, I'll just reload and uh, show me ca uh, show how to capture it or where it's at. What's great is once you tame one of them. The entire herd of any of the horses will just like, oh, you're, you're friendly. Alright. This is a reference to um, the horses that carry Helios' carriage. Right, first things first. Oh, cool. Return the forgotten wheel to the rider's resting place, and be blessed by the sun. Oh, no you don't. I see where this is going. This is about Helios and that kid of his, isn't it? It's as if the light in here is intensifying. Like the sun god himself has come close to Earth in his chariot. Just as his son did, that 
fateful day. Phoenix did not even say that. I am not wearing the blame for what happened to Faithon. And then, Zeus murdered him. Okay, first, I murder a lot of people, and you don't hear their relatives whining about it. Second, I already told you, this one was not my fault. What really happened to Phaeton then, huh? That kid had an attitude problem, always slouching around in baggy robes. No real job, complaining about how his friends didn't believe he was a proper demigod. Get better friends, kid, but no! He goes crying to daddy, says he wants the keys to the chariot, so he can show them that he's the real deal. Phaethon borrowed the chariot and took it around the earth to make sure day turned to night and night to day. I asked if I could drive that thing, but no! Zeus, you're not strong enough to hold the horses. You're not sober enough to steer in a straight line. Helios said that. I can't imagine why. Shut up! Anyway, the dumb kid's driving through the constellation, crashes into Scorpio, and zooms down so close to Earth that, well, let's just say that if your little hero thinks it's hot now, Phoenix would have roasted it alive back then. So you hit him with a lightning bolt. I did what I had to do. In all honesty, Zeus is kind of right in this regard. He didn't really... This one really isn't his fault. This is more, um... Hubris, honestly. Which is the uh, fall of many, many gods. Or many, um, humans in Greek mythology. Uh, reminder of hubris is. <clears throat> hubris is... Pride to such an extent that it is heresy against the gods, pretty much. At least that's how it's uh, described in uh, Greek mythology. So, what he did is basically just the the highest tier of hubris, believing he knew better than the gods, as well as he had a right to control. Uh, something that only the gods could control. Alright, so here is the Scorpion. So we're still after this wheel? Seriously? Scorpio snipped the thing off the chariot. This is pure sentimentalism. Wallowing won't bring him back or make anyone feel better. He did this to himself! You know, it would be perfectly understandable if you felt guilty. Alright, so this is the Scorpion. Is there another one? No. Okay. So we're looking for a cave. Where was it? Was it below us? I should just do this. Chapter. That's a Bustus. A Bustus. Alright, so it's not over here. So, yeah, this is the cave. Phoenix approached oh. the scorpion statue only to discover a vault. Hiding beneath its cold and sinister gaze. What was Scorpio's issue with Phaethon, anyway? Um... Does it involve one of your romantic adventures? Please. I have standards. Of course you do. That's why you've turned yourself into a ray of sunshine, a bull, an eagle, a goddess, a cloud. There is a long list of things that, uh, Zeus turned into to get sex. 
My favorite's still the one I mention a lot, the Golden Shower. It's absolutely hilarious. Let's tag the chest. As a side note, uh, this dungeon, hell, the cave itself, will not be here um, if you do not have the DLC downloaded. You can find Scorpio, you just can't find the cave. Zeus side with this one. If it wasn't for the arrogance of that kid, he would have been, um, uh, uh, Helios would still have a son. And besides, Helios still has plenty of sons. Nailed it. Not like that, you know, makes up for it all or anything, but, you know, still. Just like uh, Prometheus is being a little, a little too hard on Zeus in this one, because he actually did something good. Save the world from bacon. Throw. Nailed it. Shot with these in this game. Oh. Alright. Apollo, I believe, is also the god of prophecies, who's the one who, uh, he's also the one who, um, uh, gave us the prophecy, uh, at the beginning of the game. It just would not stop moving forward, and it freaked me out. That was an easy one. It wasn't for the fact these PS5 controllers are kind of pricey, I'd go out and get a new one, but...
There we go. Now, hold on a second. Alright, that should do it. Hopefully, at least. And in the hole you go. This is my second time doing this mission, so. Aha! There we go. Now, what does this give us? Because this is a DLC location. Ah, of course. Makes sense. Oh, fuck. Makes sense that give us a, uh, currency that we can spend in the game. Although, I think it'd be kind of cool if they gave us Electrum instead. Land. Chasing this wheel is not only sentimental, it's stupid. Right, because you never do anything dumb. I wouldn't touch that wheel if I were you. You'll catch something, it's filthy. I'll pray to Zeus for help. His power can purify anything. Yeah. Wait a minute. What now? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I'll pray to Zeus, he can purify anything. What? I'm the one that destroyed it. What? Do we have to go to that, uh, zoo statue then? The one that I saw at the beginning of all this? knew that only the power of Zeus could cleanse the wheel of its corruption. I haven't had a headache this bad since Athena was born. Ooh. That's a, that's a deep cut. Yeah, it is. Huh. I guess it's a good thing I cleared it out then. And I haven't um, reset the day, so that place should be cleared. Headache. I don't really need to glide, so. I, I also could just ignore these guys, too. Excuse me, lion. Hey, glide. Yeah, it is! Huh! Talk about convenient, fuck. Standing before the statue of Zeus, Phoenix was almost afraid to put the wheel on the altar. At last, some sense. This isn't helping anyone. It's morbid. Helios is trying to hold on to the past. Phoenix gently placed the corrupted wheel on the altar and stepped back. Don't look at me. It's your altar. I was away at the time, so Phoenix is out of luck. 
Suddenly, the heavens opened, and the wheel was cleansed by a blast of light. Let me guess, Helios. Now that is a chariot wheel. So shiny. If I hadn't already chained you to this rock, you can assume I'd be doing it right now. <laughs> That's kind of funny to think Phoenix about. did not know where to find Phaethon's resting place. And she suddenly remembered she was supposed to be on another quest in the first place. So she dumped the wheel and got back to work. I'll check the stars. The constellations will show me the way. What? What? The constellations are what got us into this in the first place. It was Scorpio. Uh, good thing I already solved this one. <laughs> I had time. I think this one is actually a bigger constellation one to solve. Reach the... Orica? I, I can't pronounce that. Quick glide! I love these little missions that give, uh... Some backstory, some, myth some, myth some uh, mythological stuff. It's always great. Yeah, this one was a big one. You had to climb all over this mountain to get the stuff. Glad I solved it beforehand. What was that? Phoenix knew Phaethon's resting place must be inside. I could use a resting place myself. How much longer is this going to take? Phaethon's the one who insisted on driving the chariot. Why are we dragging this old memory back up? Of course it was going to be that one. The charioteer. The constellation of the charioteer had been created by Helios himself. He wanted the world to remember his son. <laughs> this is where he fell. His sisters. Phoenix knew this story, as she knew many others. These trees were Phaethon's sisters. They had stood where their brother crashed until Helios turned them into trees so that they could watch over him forever. This is what I've been saying all along. This is what dwelling in the past gets you. They're stuck here. They lost their lives as well. We have to look forward. You are just a boy. You wanted to be known, to be a part of something. Now there's nothing to show you were ever here. I'm sorry. But Phoenix was wrong. We remember Phaethon. That's not nothing. I'm, I'm not saying we shouldn't remember him. Perhaps there is a place somewhere between living in the past and never looking back. Perhaps sometimes we simply pause and remember. I'm sorry, Phaethon. It's such a sad story, but we got a uh, cool pair of flaming wings out of it, which I may actually equip because it goes very well with very well with the uh, phoenix motif. So that's gonna be it for this set. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time when we will continue from here. Um, next time we'll probably be doing some uh, what you calls it, uh, Vaults of Tartarus, and then back to the story. But till then, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.